Hello and welcome to Ms. Ma's But Why series. This is a talk about radians. Um, and radians, of course, are an a measure of angles, just like degrees are. So if you think about centimeters and inches, those both measure distance in, this, in a similar way, but they're not exactly equal to each other. So radians are the same as degrees in terms of what they measure, but not in terms of the size of how they measure it. And uh, the reason we want to have radians is because often when you think about degrees, you'll think about an angle inside of a triangle or with parallel lines or something like that. Um, now we want to relate an angle to a circle, to the unit circle. And we want to think about how the angle relates to the radius of that circle. So let's take a look at a little animation here. Um, and this is going to just show us why the radian is what it is. It's the definition of it. So if we take that initial arm, we sweep it around, we get a radius for this circle here. And if we want to take that radius and move it along the arc length and let that arc length be the same size as the radius, we're going to define that as one radian. So one radian equals r over r, right? Like this. And so you can see that you get a little bit more than three radians in a half circle, or actually it's exactly pi radians. And if you go all the way around, you'll get um, two pi. And that's because if we did the arc length is equal to c, the circumference, then the the uh, angle would be two pi r over r, which is two pi radians. So let's take a look at some of the angles we do need to memorize. Pi equals 180 degrees, we already know that, and 2 pi is equal to 360 degrees. So if we just rearrange this formula, we get 1 radian is equal to 180 over pi degrees. If for inquiring minds, this is about 57.3 uh, degrees, I believe. So 1 radian is about that, but it's not a really nice conversion. Um, and then pi over 180 radians is 1 degree, if we just rearrange this again, which is about, so uh, 0.0175-ish radians is equal to 1 degree. So you can see this isn't a really great way to convert. We do prefer to use pi over 180, and 180 over pi um, gives us the exact value. And so if you use these conversions, that you'll get that pi over 2 is equal to 90 degrees, pi over 3 is equal to 60 degrees, pi over 6 is equal to 30 degrees, and pi over 4 is equal to 45 degrees. These aren't too hard to memorize because, you know, you've got a 4 and a 4 here, and the 3 and the 6 just switch up uh, when you do these conversions. Um, so anyways, we just talked about how radians relate the angle to the radius of the circle, and we talked about the conversion of radians to degrees. I hope that you enjoyed it. Bring me any questions you have for class. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.